welcome, to my Final Fantasy Explorers playthrough. I'm Karimo, and I just got my new 3DS with a capture card. Feel free to join me on my adventure. Skin tone seems to be okay, I guess. Laughing like an idiot while attacking? Seems good to me. LOL. Let's go with blue since it is the color of my cold and evil blood. You just have to deal with my choice. Forget about the intro, I just want to finally play the game, thanks lad. Freaky Magomed right off the bat? Are you serious? No, they weren't. That was a close one. Your attacker was none other than Behemoth, the Eidolon who rules the skies. As long as he remains, you cannot approach the Grand Crystal from above. There is a town just up ahead. Go there for now. And please, take care. My name? I am Surama. Perhaps we will meet again. Until then, farewell.
Don't remember seeing it before. You an explorer too. I'm Ludo, an explorer here in Libertas. Good to meet ya. You gotta register with the union if you wanna work. They're right along the square there. Should be an old dude out in front, that's the chief. He's the one you gotta talk to. Anything you don't understand, just ask me. I'll be glad to help you out. Later. I am not gonna give every single side character a voice, sorry. Just, shut up already. You talk too much tutorialish. Finally. Just exploring our base for a second. Hello, and welcome to the Libertas branch of the Explorers Union. I'm Sid, the one in charge of this branch office. The name rings a bell, you say? I used to be an explorer like you, but then I took an arrow to the knee. Now, you're hardly the first explorer to come hoping to benefit from a Mostra's Grand Crystal. But for all the lofty dreams and goals here, there are scads of fierce monsters waiting to squash him. I know, you, know you think you got what it takes, but we give new explorers a little test just to make sure. Pass, and you'll be registered as an explorer out of this branch office, and can work here on Amostra. First, talk to Marie, at that counter there. She'll give you the lowdown. I'm looking forward to your passing the test, and getting down to work here. Blah 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 blah. Blah. Blah blah blah. Blah blah. Let's check the controls before I actually attack. That's it? Okay then, who cares? Please, stop those annoying pop-ups. Thank you. 
So that's where the rest of my possible abilities were hiding. God! I need a pop-up blocker. This isn't cool. Well, this was rather easy. Seems like, you got your basic skills down pat. Now to see, if you know your way around a crystal surge. As you know, crystal surges work through an explorer's crystal lizard tool, using the power of crystals to bend the laws of nature, and trigger various phenomena in the vicinity. Our technology hasn't given us total control over them yet. But use them right, and you can take the upper hand in battle. Go back to the counter, and Marie will give you that crystal surge exam. Hey there! Blah 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 blah. Blah. Blah blah blah. Blah blah. Okay, I think I got it.
Did you see that? That's called efficiency. Why isn't that crystal search stuff happening? I got over 100 resonance. was worried I would fail a tutorial quest. Okay, so crystal surges shouldn't be any problem. Last but not least, ability mutations. Use an ability while a crystal surge is active, to trigger a mutation that'll boost its effects. That mutated ability then becomes a custom ability you can learn. Pass this exam, and you'll be good to go here in Amostra. Stop by the counter again, and Marie will give you that ability mutation exam. Well folks, that's it for the first part of this playthrough, and my very first Nintendo 3DS recording. Subscribe to my channel for more, and I'll see you labs next time.